The Tall Boy Experience. Hi, I'm Ian the Van Zandt. Hey, this is Motown recording artist Kim. Yo, 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 this is Kid, and this is Play together with Kid and Play. Yo, Widrill. What's up, y'all? This is Case. Right now, you are checking out myself, Music Soul Child. What up, Tall Boy? It's your man, G. Garland. Hey, this is your girl, Shirley Strawberry. Listen, if you want the experience, the Tall Boy. You're checking out the Tall Boy. The Tall Boy experience. Experience, baby. We short, but he's tall. You want the Tall Boy, because he's going to bring you the exclusive. My man, Tall Boy, about to bring you the exclusive. Get ready for it. You ready? This is the Tall Boy experience. Experience the tallness of the boy. Tall boy. Yeah, he's way up there. Tall boy is about to bring it to you. Don't go anywhere. Love you. Hey, tall boy. Hi, I'm Elisa Morgan. And do you want the exclusive? <laughs> tall boy is going to give it to you. Tune in. Tall boy. Tall boy. Experience. We are here in Atlanta, and I'm with the Miss Queens, New York, Miss Do Me Baby, Miss Melissa Morgan. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Hey, you know, I'm hanging in there. I'm good. It's it's a nice sunny day or a warm day in Atlanta. <laughs> it's hot, honey. It's hot. So, so uh, talk about your performance tonight. Um, what did you think and the, the crowd, the atmosphere? Oh, it was a wonderful crowd. Um, I went out in the audience. Everybody was getting selfies. Everybody got these selfie sticks now. So, you know, they were getting their selfie pictures. And uh, I love performing in Atlanta. So they showed me a lot of love. Yeah. So speaking of that, being out there in the crowd, what does it feel like to actually just get out there and have that intimate moment with, uh, with your fans? It feels good, you know, because then you get to see, you know, the appreciation, you know, of the music and the love and, and the hard work. You dress up to go out there and look good, you know, as you're walking around. You look good, girl, you know what I'm saying? So it feels good. Um, you, um, when you first started, you're into jazz. What was that one defining moment for you that said that this is what you wanted to do? Wow. Yeah, I, when I started, uh, I think when I started singing background with, I started singing background with Shaka Khan, that was, you know, when she told me that I'm good enough to not be singing background and be in the forefront, that was like the, you know, the aha moment for me. Yeah. Wow. wow. All right. And then we fast forward to Do Me Baby. <laughs> and now everybody loves that song. I mean, I grew up on that song right there. My mom was playing a song, and you hear it in the background. Do me, baby. What was your mom doing? I'm not. I don't know what she was doing. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not gonna ask. Um, but now you uh, have a new album coming out. Can you talk about that? Well, you know, um, I'm thankful. It's a single. Uh, it's called So Good, and um, it was actually produced by Lenny Fontana, who is an R&B uh, house uh, producer and DJ. So um, this is something new, but I think everyone's going to like it. And uh, I just heard on Heart and Soul Serious yesterday, you know, they said I'm making a comeback. So we'll see. So they're waiting for it. Yeah. It's not a comeback. You already here. I've been here. I'm working. I'm working tonight. I don't know what's a comeback. Don't call it a comeback. Just yeah. say I've always been here. So. But, I, you know, some people haven't seen me, so I love, you know, doing shows like this with Kim. I'm going on tour with Patti LaBelle wow. uh, in November. I'm doing her European tour with Patti LaBelle, SOS Band, The Whispers, uh, Loose Ends, and Soul to Soul. Yeah. Right, now, you just said you're going overseas. Can you talk about that audience overseas as opposed to that audience here in the States? Um, it's, it's a different type of a appreciation. Here they love you and they know the songs. Uh, there they appreciate the music, you know what I'm saying, the soul music more. You know, um, you don't have to have a hit to, to perform over there because, you know, they, they collect and, and they research and they save. And believe it or not, Fool's Paradise is like huge over there. Fool's Paradise is like a like a number one hit record over there. So it's like an anthem. Yeah. Uh-huh. Alright, for a young artist that's starting to get into business and they, you know, says that this is what they want to do, this is the career path. Uh, independent women or just independent artists in general, what advice would you like to leave? Learn the business. Because it's, it's more than just a show and glam. 
you know, everybody just is the hair and the clothes and, you know, the Nicki Minaj and, and the designer and, and the Kim Kardashian's, uh, you know, magazine covers and stuff like that. But you have to learn the business. It is a business. And if you don't know the business, you know, all of that stuff ain't going to mean nothing if you ain't got no money in the bank. So learn the business and learn how to put the money in the bank by doing what you do. Oh, that's big right there. What is it that you like to do for fun? Because people know your songs, they know your music, but they don't know who you are. What is it that you like to do? Well, I'm now I'm engaged. Well, congratulations. Yes, thank you, Sebastian. Hey, babe. So I like to hang out with him. You know, we like to go out and eat at different places. I love that. And uh, we like taking road trips. So I do that. Uh, I have a crochet line. Um, I crochet. And it's oversized blankets and scarves. So I like doing that. And I do um, Melissa fruit sticks, which is like edible arrangements. But bigger and better. So. And where, well, where can they find all this stuff? Oh, go on any of my social media pages and you can contact me. It's uh, Melissa Morgan 22, Facebook, Melissa Morgan 1, uh, Instagram, Melissa Morgan 2, Twitter, just Melissa Morgan, something like that. <laughs> yes. All right, my last question I got for you. Uh, what would you like to leave for your fans? Um, any message, any, any word? Wow, just look out for my new stuff. Um, you know, I did the Unsung, so you can see you know the, my little history up to now and um, you know just uh, support me I love what Tyrese is doing just telling people R&B music is not dead you know when we put stuff in that, something out you have to support it you gotta buy you know so go you know on iTunes buy buy the records you know support it and that's the only way we can keep doing what we do there it is Melissa Morgan hanging out with tall boy backstage oh, no. Oh, yeah, my, when I grow up, I'm going to be, look, I'm giving her credit now. So when I'm no longer Tall Boy, the new name will be? Tall Tall. There it is, Melissa Morgan, Tall Boy, hanging out backstage at Wolf Creek for the summer concert series. Yes. Thank you so much for your time. Tall Boy, we're gone. Did you like the video? That's right. Did you like the video? Hit that like button. Hit the share button. Share it. Think big. Think tall. Think tall boy.